In this video, I will demonstrate how to add an Arduino to Air Manager. For this example, we will be adding an Arduino Mega. Air Manager has support for various types of Arduinos, like the Mega, Uno, and Nano. You can find the full list of supported boards on our wiki. To add a new device, click the plus symbol here or on the top. In the pop-up window, select Arduino from the list, and then either double-click or select Next. Now we have to select the COM port that corresponds to the Arduino Mega from the list. You can see that in this case, it is at COM port 7. We make sure that we have the Arduino Mega selected, and since this is the first Arduino Mega we will be adding, we leave it at channel A. If you want to add another Arduino Mega, then you will have to flash this with channel B, and so on, all the way up to channel P, meaning that you can add 16 Arduino Megas to Air Manager. To start flashing, click on Add. This process will take a while. Now the Arduino Mega has been flashed and has been automatically added to the list of devices. Air Manager will start listening on COM port 7, and it will show up as soon as the device has been found. Once connected, you can see the information of this specific device. Now let's add some hardware to your simulator. Select a panel and scroll down a bit, underneath the canvas. Before we start, there are two important things to keep in mind. One, the chosen hardware functions will only be operational when the panel is running. And two, to see your inputs being represented in the instrument panel requires the simulator to be running. Now click Add Hardware to add a hardware function to this panel. For this example, we will be adding an altimeter dial. Type in altimeter, select the altimeter hardware function, and either double-click or add. Now we can start by making the various required settings. Is this altimeter dial for the pilot or co-pilot side? What type of encoder is used? And lastly, we will be defining the pins on our Arduino. In this example, we will say that the encoder A and B pins are on D2 and D3 of the Arduino. We also have the option to add a button that resets to standard barometric pressure. We will put that on pin D4. Some instruments themselves have specific hardware inputs, like the clock in this example. Right-click on the instrument in the canvas and select Configure. Scroll down, and you will see the buttons you can configure. We will put these on D5, D6, and D7. When you're done, click OK to confirm. Now you know how to add an Arduino to Air Manager and connect hardware to it. If you need any further help, don't hesitate to reach out to us. Just look at siminnovations.com support.